Hi, I'm going to explain uh, which are the main features of this new tool, Curvo Mail, a tool that is uh, able to send via email ClickView reports in an automated way. I click on OK just to log in. First thing that we can do with this tool is uh, to import uh, contacts. We have this button that permits to import contacts if you have a CSV file, an access file or whatever where you have uh, saved your contacts. Yes, I want to click it. For example, if I want to add a new row, it's just necessary to, pre to press on plus and just digit name, surname, email, address, organization, function one and function two. I just delete this row. Okay, click view file. Which click view file I want to interrogate to send the click view reports? I just add, I decide an alias. I want to analyze GFK and send reports about this topic. I go in the path. I select my click view file. I don't have any section access, so I don't need to fulfill username and password. And with this, I just save. At this moment, I can go to procedure, decide a procedure. The procedure name will be GFK. And of course, I will take the GFK click view files that I assign in uh, click view sheets. This point, I can create my message. The address C, I can make a multiple selection. I want to send it to the BI people. With this, just select all, save the selection, and it's done. All the BI addressees will receive this email. I want to add a, a CC addressee. I can choose from the list and I will just save and close and that's done. I can insert the object so GFK report and the body of the message like good morning mister and with the alt key control plus P I can access to this window where I can take the surname again control plus P and the name let's save the selection so what I've just done is just uh, inputting the two parameters that will change the um, depending on the address C so, Davide Tureta will receive good morning, Davide Tureta, Nicola Novello will receive good morning, Novello Nicola. Here in attachment, the report. If I want to save, I can save uh, uh, the attachments in uh, a folder that I decide before, but I don't want in this moment. So I can start to define which att attachments I would like to send. So first of all, I can decide the XLS file name. I will say report to be easy. I will save. I will open it again. I will add a record. So here I'm uh, going to interrogate the click view file associated to this procedure. I want to take distribution, save selection. I can decide the name of the sheet. So let's say distribution. And I can decide the title. If I don't want to write it and I want to use the original title, I just have to flag this field and just save. I want a one more sheet. So let's go to interrogate again the click view file and choosing which object I want to send. I choose statistics. I give the name to the sheet. And let's say sales as the type as title and just save. Here I can make the selections. So I have bookmarks 
if I have bookmarks in the click view file I can choose uh, from the bookmarks that I created in the click view file I have just one and I want to create these selections that is uh, October 2010 Russia in addition I want uh, one more selection so when I'm pressing uh, this browse I'm, I'm going to interrogate again the click view file and he's giving me which are the field that I can uh, where I can make a selection so name of the field is uh, for example brand and here I'm going to interrogate the values of this uh, field so here I have all the brand that uh, I have in uh, in the click view file so I just choose Rex I save the selection this field is not calculated so I don't need to flag it and I just save it's done I have just to enable the right procedure and click on run and and it's done yes